Hi, this is Dan from the ECU Pro. Today we're working on a BMW 325. The customer sent this in for testing, sent his DME in. Sent a DME, his cast module, and his key. What we do is we take a BMW 325 out of our fleet, bring it up, install the parts into it, start it, run it, and see if we can get the same faults that the, the customer is complaining about. If we can't, we do some more testing. If everything's fine with it, we charge a small fee and send the items back to the customer. If we do find faults with it, the options are we can repair it, or if it's major damage like water or something else, we can clone it to a replacement. Either way, we take video of the car starting and running and send it to you via email. For DME removal, first thing you want to do is remove the key. Make sure the car's off. And in this car, it sits in this under this cover. There may be some air ducts that you have to remove. Um, we probably removed them for ease of use. But you take this cover off, and here it is. It will be sitting vertical, not laying like this. It's the two black plugs. Just pop the plugs out and send us the DME. For cast removal, this one in particular is white. It's a cast two. There are occasions where your vehicle will have a cast three, which is black, but it will still resemble this. It will have one big plug and one small plug. So what you want to do is, there's a panel under here. And you're going to take off three screws. You're going to pull the panel down. Ours is removed for ease of use, but it pulls down, and the cast module will be sitting up under there, being held on by a bolt. Take the bolt off, take the two plugs out, send us the cast module, the key and the DME, all three parts are important for testing and we'll take it from there.